Hello friends, welcome to the channel Solution. Today, in this video, we will show you how to use separating funnel. Separating funnel is generally used to separate the mixture of two immiscible liquid or it is used for liquid-liquid extraction. So, first of all, let's know the different parts of separating funnel. And this video is also available in Hindi explanation. Link of the video is given in the description box. At the top, this is the glass stopper of the separating funnel. And at the time when we drain out the liquid from the separating funnel, we have to remove this stopper from the separating funnel. And when we shake or at the time of extraction in the separating funnel, we have to tightly close the separating funnel with the help of this glass stopper. And in this part of conical shape, we have to fill the liquid mixture which we want to separate. This is the stopcock of the separating funnel. We have to open this stopcock when we want to drain out, means to collect the liquid out from the separating funnel. And at the time of shaking or you can say extraction, we have to tightly close this stopcock. And always before starting the experiment, check this stopcock if there is any leakage or not. And this is the stem of the separating funnel from which the liquid comes out in the container in which we collect the liquid. If the stopper of the separating funnel is loose, means not tightly fit to the joint of the separating funnel, then in that case we have to grease the stopper. Here we have taken very small amount of the petroleum jelly for greasing the stopper. Put a thin layer of petroleum jelly on the surface of the stopper and after that attach the glass stopper with the joint. Now our separating funnel is properly sealed means the stopper is tightly fit to the joint. And after this with the help of clamp and stand fit the separating funnel in the upright position and then close the stopcock tightly. And then remove the glass stopper from the separating funnel and then transfer 20 to 25 ml of water into the separating funnel. We are doing this step just to check is there any leakage from the stopcock of the separating funnel. Here you can see there is no leakage from the side of the stopcock and after this remove the funnel and then tightly close the separating funnel with the help of glass stopper and then remove the separating funnel from the clamp by rotating the screw and then press your finger over the stopper and then invert the separating funnel. Here we are doing this step to check is there any leakage from the stopper side of the separating funnel. Here you can see that there is no leakage of the liquid from the stopper side of the separating funnel. Means our separating funnel is now ok for doing the experiment. Now we have to transfer the liquid mixture of immiscible solvent which we want to separate. Here we have transferred the liquid which we want to extract inside the separating funnel. Before transferring the liquid, keep the funnel on the stopper side of the separating funnel. Transfer the liquid inside the separating funnel with the help of funnel. First of all, we have to transfer the liquid which we want to extract and then we have to transfer the extracting solvent. Here we are transferring the liquid sample which we want to extract through the funnel into the separating funnel and then we are transferring the extracting solvent for the extraction of the liquid which we have added into the separating funnel the case of liquid liquid extraction method we have to note that we must not fill the separating funnel completely with the liquid means we have to add the liquid sample inside the separating funnel in such a volume so that there will be a sufficient space above the liquid inside the separating funnel for the proper extraction of the liquid as you can see in the video now we can start the extraction process. For this, first of all, tightly close the separating funnel with the help of glass stopper and then remove the separating funnel from the clamp and check whether the glass stopper is tightly closed or not and then, and then tightly place your finger over the glass stopper and then completely invert the separating funnel and then back to the normal position and then invert the separating funnel and then again back to the normal position. We have to repeat this process two to three times and after doing this process two to three times we have to release the vapor pressure developed inside the separating funnel. For this completely invert the separating funnel and then slightly open the stopcock of the separating funnel. When we open the stopcock then you can hear a whistle which is due to the release of the vapor pressure which is developed inside the separating funnel and then again tightly close the stopcock of the separating funnel and then again start the extraction process means again completely invert the separating funnel and then back to the normal position and then again repeat the process two three times for the complete extraction and then after the complete process of extraction then fit the separating funnel again with the help of clamp and then wait for the liquid mixture to separate into two distinct layer and when the two layer of the liquid get completely separated and to collect the lower layer of the liquid inside the separating funnel 
first of all remove the stopper glass stopper from the separating funnel and then slightly open the stop cock here you can see the lower layer of the liquid is coming out through the stem into the container into the beaker which we have kept below the separating funnel the lower transparent layer of the liquid starts to come out drop by drop through the stem of the separating funnel into the beaker and we have to note that at the time of collection of the liquid out from the separating funnel always remove the glass stopper from the top of the separating funnel and the, when the lower layer of the liquid completely comes out from the separating funnel then immediately we have to tightly close the stop cock of the separating funnel so that the upper layer will not get mixed with the lower layer which we want to separate it from here you can see that we have collected the transparent lower layer of the liquid into the beaker and and similarly you can collect the upper green layer of the liquid in the another container so this is how we operate the separating funnel and perform the liquid liquid extraction method thank you very much for watching this video